Greetings, RC Model Geeks! And here we are. In the shed. Yeah, again, with Mad Colin. Hi guys, how you doing? <laughs> or is it Mad Pete? Oh no, it's Mad no, Colin. No, it's me. <laughs> no. For part seven of the PB Models Crescent Tornado, as supplied by Cloud Models. Thanks, Phil. Yeah, thanks, Phil. Thanks, Phil. So, yeah, Matt Collins here. We've been having some fun, haven't we, mate? We've been oh, yeah. correcting all Pete's problems. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, Pete was here this morning. Uh, we managed to get rid of him for a little while so we could actually concentrate on the real work of building this plane. Yeah. Rather than putting dinks and donks in it. <laughs> 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 Pete's a bit like a bull in a china shop, isn't he, Cole? Oh, bloody oh, hell, yeah. Oh, mate. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, we've been trying to get some stuff out of the way while he's doing family stuff. Yeah. So, what have we done today? Okay, let's have a quick gand. So, we started to chonk some bits off this, uh, off this bit of wood. Um, you know, just to start shaping it slightly. A lot of work to do on that yet. Uh, blah, blah, blah. But we've got the, uh, the disc stuck on the front. Mm -hmm. You see, we've got to shape the whole lot too. Mm-hmm. Uh, so that's good. Uh, we've removed this for the moment because um, we were working on other things. Uh, we've sort of finalised the undercarriage. We've got that mounted on. We soldered a washer on there mm -hmm. so that the uh, the wheel um, works right. Um, yeah, uh, so that is all uh, good. That's all we've done actually. Yeah. Isn't it? It's, in, it's like half past one. Um, but yeah, we were just doing a little bit of fettling, make sure things work right, and a bit of pre-planning as well for where certain things are going to go. Um, undercarriage, oh, beautiful, I mean, yeah. shall we? Yeah. Ready? Wink! Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Wink! Works and, well. oh, that's what we did, that's what we did, mate, that's what took us all morning, cutting that out. Oh, yeah. Uh, remember now? So that is the block that's going to go underneath, mm -hmm. where the wheel comes out through. When we get it right, in the right place, it does fit. So yeah, that's got to get all stuck on. Lovely jubbly. Hmm. So yeah, that's, that is all finalised there. Ring! It's going to be good. It's going to be good. Yeah, yeah, you're not wrong, mate. You're not wrong. Oh, bloody annoying, this undercarriage. I keep getting in the way all the time, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> it's either up when it wants to be down, or it's down when it wants to be up. And then when you want to remove it, you've got to like get your hand in here and dip it. So, we've got to work out next, um, as it's more sort of engineering-y, um, where we're going to mount the servo for this wheel. Yeah. For this undercarriage. Um, they've got a, like um, a false bottom in here. As you can see, it's like 16 ply, which would have been for the tank originally. It's the tank bay. Uh, That's going to be a battery compartment. Mm -hmm. So we're going to put a false floor in there, and then the servo for the, uh, for the undercarriage uh, is going to mount onto that. That false floor is going to be screwed in yeah. So we can take it out again if we need to. Mm -hmm. um, so we can access this compartment down here because that's pretty sort of covered in, you know, once once we've got the bottom on. Uh, yeah, so that is our, uh, our next thing. I think we'll stick a couple of bits of square along the inside and then put that plate in and work out how to mount the survey. Hmm. Easy, isn't it? Piece of cake. Piece of cake, yeah. Any finished bits you want to show off? Nope. Okay. Um, <laughs> well, there isn't any, is there, really? Um, you know, Pete's been doing some of the sanding. Hmm. Um, and I've been doing the filling afterwards. <laughs> yeah. Like the bit when he put the fuselage on the plan, uh, not the plan, the pen even. Oh, the pen, yeah. Oh, oh, do you know what? He was sanding the fuselage like, this morning, wasn't he? Yeah. And he was pushing down like this on the bench. Yeah, bloody hell, there's a pen underneath it. Hmm. Pete! Oh. So instead of, oh, Phil, it was, oh, Pete. Pete. Yeah, that's going to be the new saying. Oh, yeah. Pete! Yeah. 
Yeah. So, yeah, we're getting there though. It's all coming together and it will suddenly. Ting. Ting! And it'll be finished. Like awaking from a dream. But yeah. So, that's it. Back soon when we've done something, eh, Carl? Yeah, let's do something. Yeah, let's do something. Right, well, we've been busy. Salt Marsh is coming back in a minute. Yeah. So we had to get our finger out, didn't we? Yes. <laughs> we've not been idle. We've not been idle. You can hear that noise. That is something idling. Yeah. Oh, a servo moving. Yeah. Go on then. Shall I? Yeah. Okay. And there it is. There is a nose leg. Yeah. <coughs> all working. Uh, we've got all the geometry sorted out, everything. Uh, it's only the servo is just temporarily um, <coughs> clipped in there, but that's where it's going. Uh, all works lovely jubbly. Nothing wrong with that at all. Just perfectly touches the, uh, the wood. Hmm. So we've got a false uh, floor in there, or not so false floor now. Um, yeah, and it works brilliantly. Oh, let's salt marsh. He's just turned Whoa. up in his car. So we're going to uh, come back in a minute. Uh, we'll, well, we're going to wind him up before that. Yeah, of course <laughs> we are. You'll go, oh, what have you been doing? You ain't done nothing. Uh, but we have. Oh, yes. And yeah, I think that's quite good, actually. Yeah. Um, we might also tell him that he, uh, when he marked out the cutout, uh, that the nose leg, because he actually put the nose leg in, didn't he? Yeah. And he put the nose leg in backwards, so yes. the cutout was the wrong way around. But Good anyway, mind. nothing about that. But it's all working now. We have done our job. Hmm. Back soon. Yep. Cheers, Ed. Cheers. Right. Well, Pete's finally uh, Back turned again. up. Yeah, after uh, Colin and me done all the hard work. Colin's gone home now. He's got to have a lay down. He's, he's, he hasn't worked so hard for weeks. I'm a little bit disappointed we haven't got the covering out. Oh, I know, I know. We didn't say we'd get it covered, <laughs> did we? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> no. Uh, so, what do you reckon then, Pete? Do you like it? Well, as you know, I've, I've measured the centre line coming here yeah, to the centre line of the wheel. It. Bang on. I'm looking down. It's not touching at all in any position. Yeah. It's solid. Rod's not touching. The old servo arm's now being glued in. Yeah, yeah. Glued yeah. and screwed. Yeah, that servo's mounted in there. And I've stuck this bit of wood on as well here. And rough shaped it as well. So, uh, yeah, quite a uh, a worthwhile day. We had to get the uh, undercarriage working, or the nose working, because we wanted to stick this bit on. So, um, yeah, looking very good so far. And we did say we used the original in the box. Yeah, nose leg, yeah. Because this one was just yeah. a little bit Yeah, it's a little too bit smaller. Thin. Well, plus it needed turning round 90 degrees because these legs are really for the main wheels, not the nose leg, and we sort of modified it to work as a nose leg as well. Um, yeah, so that's, uh, that's good, really. All moving forward. We, we like that. So, um, yeah, uh, be a short video tomorrow because uh, I've got things to do in the afternoon. Um, but we're sure we will get something out. I don't know what we're going to do tomorrow, Pete. Um, you got a life outside modelling then? No. Oh, right, OK. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how's your nose, mate? My nose? Yeah. Fine. Oh, good. So, uh, we're going to go now, anyway. Uh, and uh, I'm going to let you watch a little bit of video. Uh, just for a little laugh. And we'll see you all tomorrow for part eight. Got part eight already. Oh, hang on. You haven't got that. <laughs> see you all tomorrow. <laughs> I've just Bye. tweaked. Bye. <laughs> I've just tweaked. Never put anything on Facebook, oh, mate. Dude. That's what I say. Blimey. Not yet. Oh, right. Well, yeah. you're not ready, Pete. <laughs> you've got to brace yourself. I want to close my eyes. Just relax. Just relax. Oh, yeah. To I be fair, there was blood. a lot of hair on there. No, you didn't have no blood. God, that's a good one, that is. Oh. 
Oh. <laughs> I can breathe now. There you go, I told you. So make you breathe easier. Just get those little bits of wax. Yeah, you can finish now. Thank you for watching Captain Rob's RC Model Geeks. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to click that like button. If you want to see more of the same type of videos, don't forget you can subscribe. If you want to support us, you can use PayPal, paypal.me forward slash RC Model Geeks. If you want to contact us, you can email us rcmodelgeeks at gmail.com. We look forward to seeing you in the next video.